Okay, I might just go ahead and do a voiceover thing for this instead of on camera because this is the lighting from inside my car just right over there so since the lighting is so bad and you can barely see me i'm just gonna turn both those off and then you get a voiceover with some mission impossible dead reckoning part one footage overlaying over this i'm gonna try to do more pre-show pre-theater reactions as well as post theater post movie reactions to different movies that i see and put them up, up more often on my channel especially i think it'll be a, a great time this month in july with these big three movies coming out with mission impossible barbie and then with oppenheimer coming out later this month in july but oh yes finally on my way to Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 1, one of my most anticipated movies of the year. Mission Impossible franchise being probably my top two, top three favorite franchises. The trailers look awesome. Obviously, the Rotten Tomato score has been like 97, 98, 99, 100% or so. It's been like tipping up and down, so we'll see how well all that stacks up. Very excited. I am super, super curious to see what the, all the buzz and awesomeness and see if that high Rotten Tomato score is, uh, is high enough and is worth it and uh, actually works well with the movie. Without further Video, let's run to the movie and see how well and how great all the action stacks up. Okay, out of the movie, pretty good. A little long, but pretty good. Really, really cool addition to the Mission Impossible franchise. Really good closing out chapters to the Mission Impossible franchise. A little bit confusing here and there. Some of the, uh, how things work in the story and some of the character relationships, I kind of got confused with who's the bad guy, who's the good guy in these situations and whatnot, whatever. I think it demands a number of free watchings in the theater or whenever, which is what I'm gonna do. Probably gonna rewatch this again in the theater, but pretty cool. A lot of really great spectacle, a lot of really great um, action sequences for sure. There's a whole sequence on the train that was really spectacular and awesome and ended in kind of an iffy kind of way. But anyway, all that aside, very cool movie. Go check it out. Uh, if you're a Mission Impossible fan like myself, you'll very very much be impressed. If, you just, if you're just looking for a summer blockbuster that's coming out now, I think you'll be impressed as well and have a really good time. Go ahead and check this one out. A couple of questions I have here and there, Not quite a perfect movie but still really really good really really cool i'm not sure about top five um among my top five list of the year but probably top 10 or so really good movie go ahead and check it out i was i'm very very impressed with everything that i saw i'm i'm very pleased with the i'm pretty pleased with the script for the most part for the most part i think i like this story a little bit more than fallouts um i don't know i'm kind of even on which one do i like more dead reckoning part one or fallouts kind of on the same playing field anyway really enjoyed this go ahead and check this movie out for yourself